So hi, my name is Pitikon Teng Takun and my nickname is Te. Te is just like a backpack. This is Pudding. Pudding is a cat, not a monkey. So I'm working now in KBDG as a cyber security team. And before joining KBDG, I was working at the telecommunication companies. Joining KBDG is one of the biggest challenges, but actually one of the most successful challenges I ever done for Pudding as well. Let's imagine, you can compare it to the COVID-19. You are trying to protect yourself from the COVID. There will not be mad people like trying to, with the injection, try to inject you with the COVID virus. On the other hand, for the cyber attack, there will always be people trying to get those viruses into your computer. To get your information, the access right to all of your devices, maybe eventually to get some of the money in your banking account. So the cyber security is the art to protect you against all those bad people in the cyber world. In our cyber security team, we have about 60 people divided into three small teams, security assurance. So we make sure that every security policy are followed and complied by people. The second team of security architects, they will approve the solution or the blueprint of any application, any server, any IT infrastructure. And the last one, security operation team. We have that kind of CSI cyber team. They have to stay up all night 24 seven trying to protect us. We also have another team who try to hack our own software and system just to make sure that we already have the protection and we close all the possible windows and doors. The main challenging problems of cybersecurity is communication. We have to make sure that they understand what the cybersecurity is. They know what it could harm them, or what could be the consequence, the bad one, and they know how to protect themselves. Usually, the user will think they just come to work and the system or the banking system will protect them. Regardless of how strong you have for your walls, your doors, your windows. If the user in your house open the windows for bad people by themselves, it will be useless. That's why we have to make sure that every single one of the staff know what they could do, such that they will not cause harm to themselves, to the bank, and eventually it could cause harm to the supply chain and other businesses as well. You need to have a really high curiosity. If you see something wrong, you ask question. If you see something good, you also ask question. The second one, you need to have a really high self-discipline. Some of your work will be really technical that no one else in the company will be able to monitor or even to inspect your work. And that will lead to the last one and the most important one, the ethic or the moral. So you need to make sure that you know what is good and why are you doing that? And do you follow the proper protocol? So basically, high curiosity, self-discipline, and very, very high ethics are the three main components for the people who want to work in the cyber security position. You never know, that is my answer. Because cybersecurity is like a specific type of curry. It tastes so good, but only for some people. So my best recommendation is to test it early. That means if you want to work in cybersecurity, maybe you have to familiarize yourself with the cybersecurity elements. Maybe the events, training, internship, and feel it. Whether or not these kind of things excite you, make you feel like your heart pumping, if you feel something like that, you'll be really welcome to join us.